Hey! Okay. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to the stream. Today we have a great stream uh, planned for you guys. We are gonna be doing another tier list, but this time we're gonna be doing movies. And we found a tier list that has, honestly, like I'm looking at it right now, like the most random collection of movies. Like they're not really like related to each other at all. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Yeah, like it's a real mix, which I'm excited about because we've got a little bit of everything on here. And I feel like whoever made this tier list did a really good job at picking up movies that I feel like a lot of people have seen. Although I'm literally looking at the first one, I haven't seen it, so crickets, I haven't, I haven't actually either. crickets. I haven't seen the first two, actually. I don't know what the second one yeah, is. Yeah, me either. Um, okay. Well, <laughs> let's get into it though. I wish these ads would go away. I need to get like ad blocker or something. So you guys remember the rules. This time there, are, I think there are less categories. I think it like yeah. went down to F last time. This time it only goes down to D, but that's fine. That's fine, yeah. Okay, you ready to start? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, the first one we have Star Trek Into Darkness. Darkness. Like I said, I have not seen this movie. I haven't um, either. Should we make a category for we haven't seen it? I mean, maybe. Can we do that? Can we, like, add a new category? Add a row below. Perfect. All yeah, right, so there we go. I have not seen Star Trek Into Darkness. You haven't seen it, so yeah. obviously we're just going to put it in, into that category. Sorry yeah. for all of uh, my Star Trek fans. What is this next movie? Mask of Light? Mask of Light. I haven't seen that either. Just, no, I've never seen it. Sorry, no. I've also never seen Rango. I have. You have? Mm -hmm. Did you like it? Mm. It feels like a fever dream. When I'm looking at this, I feel like I'm like... <laughs> I have a fever. Rango is a weird movie. Okay, why don't you put it in D because you've seen it, but it's obviously not memorable enough for you to remember anything that happened. In yeah, it, so. clearly it's not. Can, I'm trying to move these now. Wait, what did you say to do with it? It's going in D. It's going in D. Okay. okay. Super, Super eight. eight. Do you know what it's about? No, I haven't seen it. So I know what it's about, but I've never seen it. Oh, you you, you haven't seen it. I no. thought maybe you have seen it, but you forgot. Is it, it, it about aliens? About. I feel like I've seen this movie. Like I'm looking at it and I really feel like I have seen it. Dude, Elle Fanning. I love Elle Fanning. Is this so we Stranger put it in Things? <laughs> this looks just like Stranger before. Things. I'm trying to like see if it's jogging my memory. Oh, um, okay. I don't think I've seen this. Okay, so let's put it in here. The Grey. I've seen this movie. I've never seen it. I'm looking like I've never seen any movies, but I have. <laughs> you really, really are looking like you've never seen them. Okay, but okay. So I've seen this movie. I don't know if you guys have seen this movie, but there is a part of the movie. It's really early on, so it's not a spoiler. Um, also, it came out years ago, so whatever. Well, the whole movie is like they get stranded in the winter wilderness. Okay. And it starts off with a plane crash. And honestly, this movie is memorable because the plane is crashing and he like seat belts himself in across like three seats. And he's like one of, or maybe the only person who survives the plane crash. Oh. So I'm like watching it and I'm like, oh my God, if I'm ever on a plane and it's yeah. crashing, I'm going to kick and everyone out of my yeah. row and then seat belt myself in all okay. three seats. Okay. Noted. <laughs> Never sit next to Jen on the plane. <laughs> but this movie was fine. Like, I probably put it in, like, C. It's not, like, my type of movie. Okay. It's not, like, something I would typically watch. I've seen this movie, Warm Bodies. I actually haven't seen this movie. I would wait, 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 wait. Is she, like, dating a dead person? Yeah. I well, have seen this movie, there's another movie where somebody's dating a dead person that you might have seen. Oh, okay, wait, let me look this it up. This one is with Nicholas No, I haven't Holt, seen this movie. I think wait. it's his name. No, I haven't this seen this. This girl, I can't remember her name. You're thinking of something else I, that I've also seen. What am it's, I thinking I would of? say D, absolutely. It's one D. of the worst movies I've ever seen. <laughs> is it really? <laughs> yeah, it's really, it's pretty bad. Wait, people are saying unwatchable, unwatchable garbage. garbage. Okay, Agreed. trash, throw it yeah. away. Okay. Guys, did you I guys do this I actually like this actor, though. He's from Skins. First season of Skins. First generation of Skins. Sick. I've never seen anyone do that before. No, D. Okay. 21 Drum 21 Street. 21 Jump Street. Yeah. Yeah, obviously seen this. We've all seen this. I think it's funny. I like I it. it's a funny movie. I would... I would put it in B maybe. Or That's C. what I was gonna put it in. Yeah. Or I guess S is like the top tier. Yeah. I put it in A or B. I think honestly, because it's pretty funny. I liked it. I think B. This is what I like to call like a box office comedy. They're made for everyone in the United States to enjoy. Right. So it's kind of like generic comedy, but it's good. It's like good. some it's of them funny. are good. Yeah. Like some of those types of movies. Sparta or whatever. I've never seen this movie. I've never it seen this like either. like a type of movie that I would really not enjoy. Actually, that's a lie. I, I was there <laughs> while someone else was watching this movie. So I've seen it, but I didn't watch it. Honestly, the reason why I'm not interested in watching this movie is because it's just not my genre, you know? Like Same. these types 
types of movies are not like my. No. Uh, it's called Three Hundred. Men whatever. shirtless on the cover. No. Well, it's just not my type. Like <laughs> war movies, not my. my yeah, no. Let's um, do. Let's do Never Seen. Okay, Never Seen. Okay, John Wick. I've seen this. I've never seen any of these movies. This is like a a classic like series. I think it's good. I mean, again, like this isn't like my genre, but like I I did watch it. Was like I, an action movie. Yeah, and it's like. It's good. Okay. And people really like it. Like, I know that if we rate it low, people are going to be really mad. So we should put it higher. Maybe I should watch these movies. Yeah, it is, like, good. Why don't you put it with with, with 21? Yeah, I'll put it up here. Super bad A, I would put it in. Super bad is definitely a classic movie. Classic. I put it in A, too. I would almost put it in S, just because it's then inspired, I like, know. Booksmart. And a lot of other movies, yeah, actually, too. It's, like, a yeah. type of movie. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's true. It's, it like, kind inspire, of iconic. Yeah. Okay, put it in S. Okay, we're gonna put it in S. Where's Bad Night, LMAO? <laughs> People are mad about me putting Super Bad above John Wick, but listen, you guys, I like my genre is comedy. I like watching comedies and thrillers. Like thrillers. Yeah, yeah, so sorry about it. Okay, this is um, A Quiet Place. Never seen it. If we were doing TV shows, I would get all of these. I would know all of them. I liked A Quiet Place a lot for like a couple of different reasons. Like I thought it was a good concept. Like how the majority of the movie is like in sign language. And like the daughter in the movie is, <gasps> my light just turned off, uh, is deaf. And she's like a deaf actress in real life. You know oh, cool. I mean? And so the That's other great. actors we love like learn sign language, stuff like that. Okay, so where would you put it? I put it in A. Okay. Honestly. You do need Because I thought it was in a. pretty good. Yeah. This is the social network, right? Okay. I feel like you have a big opinion about no, the I was. Network. I thought you might. Oh, no. I honestly don't really have a huge Oh, I liked opinion. it. Yeah? Yeah, it was okay. Like, I would put it in A or B. Maybe B. I don't know. I feel so indifferent about a social network because for a lot of reasons. It's like a fine movie, but like, I don't really care about the plot. I think that it's a B. Okay. Or C. I, I would put it in C just because when I looked at B, B I right. was like, I don't want to put it in the same category know, as those movies. I know. Coraline. I would put Coraline in A, I'm not gonna lie to you. But you yeah. haven't seen it. I have not seen Coraline, which I know I might be like attacked. It's really I good. Notice a lot of people really like Coraline. It is really good. Wow. <laughs> I know. I I'm like, it really good. Out. It is good. It is a really good movie. So or. since you've seen it and I haven't, you say you'd put it in A? Mm -hmm. Okay. What is this? Fantasia. Oh, Fantasia. <laughs> Dude, why could I not go with that one? I haven't seen this. It's really old, I have to say. Like, I remember liking it when I was a kid. You have seen it? Yeah, yeah. I've seen, like, all those, like, movies. So, I guess you have to rate it, but you haven't seen it in so I long. Don't, I don't even remember what it's about. Someone said it's a flop. Okay, just People are saying D, D. Put it in D, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh. for his new group. I love this movie. <laughs> I love this movie too. This was a good movie. Although I ha it's been years since I've last seen it. I'm not gonna lie, but I remember being really, really fond of it. Okay, A. I would put it in S or A. Cause out of all of the animated movies I remember watching as a kid, I think I watched this one more than okay, once. Okay, I think it belongs in S. You're right. It okay. is like one of the best of those movies. Okay, Atlantis, The Last M M. I've definitely Pyre. seen this, but I don't. I don't know. I actually haven't seen it. Wait, uh, people say must watch, so good. A for sure. S, where it belongs. Honestly, like, maybe I have some movies to watch after this. I think A, maybe. Let's do A. We'll do A. The Departed. I've seen this movie. Oh my gosh. S. Yeah. 100%. It's S. pretty good. Pretty good? I just can't remember it. Dude, that's my problem with these movies is, like, I feel like anything I've watched, like, over... The cast is so good. I know, I know. But anything I've watched over a couple years ago, I'm, like, having trouble remembering it. Unless it, like, really stood out to me. But I do remember this being really good. What are people saying? Yeah, I think it's one of the best movies ever made. I agree, yes. Made me gay, not gonna lie. What is going on? This This one? one? <laughs> Okay, here's another John Wick movie. I honestly would just put it in the same category as B because when I saw this original John Wick movie, I thought it was going to be the only one that was in here. So I'm going to put it in the same thing. People are going to be mad about it, I guess. Okay, Zombieland. I remember this movie. Oh, I like this movie. I like this movie too. I would definitely put it with 20, 21 Jump Street like in the same category. You put it in B? Okay, let's put this in B. Brother Bear. Dude, <laughs> what is this? I feel this. like I've seen it. I, I probably really have, see, but I like I it looks newish. Oh no, two thousand. No, it's definitely old. Oh, I have I've seen, seen this movie. Yeah, I have I've seen, seen this. this. Okay. Um. This is a cute, cute movie. I put it in A. Okay, guys, this next movie, Pokemon. Pokemon, the first movie. You better believe I've seen this a couple times. Yeah, I know. Have you seen this? I believe it. No. I've seen a couple Pokemon movies, so I need to just like jog my memory on which one this is. Is this the one where they like have the battle at the end or whatever? I'm almost positive it is. I don't know. With the clones. Yes, this movie is good. This is good, and it made me cry. Like, I'm not kidding. <laughs> it's really sad. It is. Don't laugh. I'm it's not, really sad. At the end, there's like this sad part, and they all start like crying like oh I can't 
They start start crying in the fucking movie. They like have the battles Pokemon in do. all. Of them. No, but I'm talking about that huge battle between the two, like these guys, Mewtwo and the other one, Mew. Oh my god, I can't right, believe I have we, like a, put it in S? a memory of this. Like me knowing all the names of Pokemon. I used to play this game a lot as a kid. I would put it in A or S. I feel like I should put it in S. This for one Ricky. made me gay. <laughs> this one made me gay. <laughs> Stop. I, this one's, I'm gonna put an S here for Ricky. And it's a good movie. Okay, what is this thing over here? Oh, Edge, Edge of, of Tomorrow. Tomorrow. I feel like it might be something else. I've never seen it either way. So. I haven't seen this either, unfortunately. Um, okay. Dumbo. Dumbo. Oh, I love Dumbo. Dumbo's good. Dumbo's good. I would put it in B. Was Dumbo racist? Wait, was, was Dumbo it? racist? Oh my god. Uh, you know what, guys? I haven't seen this movie since I was a kid. Straight I really up, hope so it's not. I really don't know. Wow, it what? won an Academy Award. It came out in the 40s? I'm freaking out. Really? Dumbo is so racist. Oh my god. Okay, so I let's not to even I, do. Let's yeah, just put it down just, here. Okay. <laughs> this movie, guys, I can't remember what it's called, but I've seen it. Um, is that Amy Adams? Yes, and this movie's really good. Is it about aliens? Yes, and Amy Adams, like, literally like learns this alien language and communicates <laughs> with the aliens. It's crazy. Wait, can you zoom in so I can see the title? Arrival, arrival. Arrival. Yes, okay. let's go chat. I liked it a lot. Okay. I would put it in A, honestly. I thought it was a really good movie. I love Amy Adams. Her performance was amazing. I like alien movies. I'm sold. Amy Adams deserved the Oscar. She did so good in this movie. She really did. Okay, put it in S. Okay, we'll put it in S. Okay, Mary Poppins. Love. Yes, I love. <laughs> Is this A? I have to put this in A. Yeah. Oh, okay. This has to go back in A. But it's so good. But I'm just thinking about it. I'm like, it doesn't feel right in S. But, like, it is really good. Okay, Mary Poppins made you gay. <laughs> I'd put it in B. Okay. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of iconic, though. That's the only problem. Put it in A. Okay, we'll put it in A. Baby Driver, I have not seen this movie. I really want to see it, but I haven't seen it. I think we have to put Baby Driver and Never Seen because we, we both haven't it seen it. Pitch Perfect, I have never seen this movie. What? This You're is like kidding, a right? nightmare of a movie for me. You've never seen this movie? Wait, what? No, I've never... Anything where people are singing in movies, like, I don't like but it. But it's literally Pitch Perfect. Like, everybody, like, saw this movie. No, not me. Everyone's gonna freak out because I haven't seen it, I guess. Gay Awakening, what's going on in Pitch Perfect? Okay, well, listen, you guys... <laughs> Guys, you know I don't like musicals, and I don't know if this has musical vibes, but it looks like it has musical vibes, does, which is why I've never seen the movie. It's not like a musical. It's like they're a movie about acapella groups, like, on a college campus. So they're, like, singing, but they're, like, uh, singing. Like, do they, like, break out into song to help move the plot along? That's all you have to say. Like, yes or no. But they're not songs. So, like, yes. Okay, but listen. So, like, musical, that's why I musical, don't want to watch it. In a musical, they have, like, conversations through song. Do you know what I mean? Yes, but and I don't is, like that's that. That's not this. They're just doing they're like things oh wait no people are saying they don't they, they don't they're like okay. doing their songs why do you say they do i did i never said that i was trying to explain it oh okay stop we're gonna watch it okay okay um okay where do we put pitch perfect then because i haven't seen it so you have to rate it i'm getting hot i know um, I should do, let me turn that off really quick i'll do it don't worry i'm putting it in a guys where'd you put I'm it i'm not putting it in s because jen hasn't seen it i feel like we can't put something in s actually you put pokemon in s but that wasn't, <laughs> that wasn't an exception because you did it for ricky i feel like we can't put something in s that one of us hasn't seen because like we have to agree about it being s you know okay this is the spongebob squarepants movie iconicism i agree this is such a good movie i've this seen it multiple a, times a good movie it's such a good movie where should we put it s or a i think we could put it in s i think we could put it in s, s too. for the culture honestly yeah because spongebob is like shaped my entire personality like that is why I am who I am today because of SpongeBob. It's kind of true, actually. No, it's I'm not even joking. Like it's for real. What's next? What is this movie? I can't. War never. Get my glasses on. Somebody help. Fury. Fury. Fury it's on the thing he's holding right there. Oh. Sh that's just like. Oh. <laughs> I'm reading the the lo the little log line or whatever yeah. in the movie. Okay. Fury. I've never seen this. And I'm gonna guess that Rachel hasn't either. Have you seen this movie? No. Sandy was my gay awakening. Stop. <laughs> You guys are just gay. That's it. <laughs> I'm dead. Is this movie anyone's gay awakening? I'm going to put it Fury. in. <laughs> if not, we're putting it in D. I'm putting it in never seen because we haven't seen it. Okay. Spaceballs. I've never seen this. Okay, I have seen this movie, but it's like literally a fever dream to me. Yeah, this is so feverish to me. Oh, I have seen this. I feel like it's such a classic movie. That was such a type of humor. It's a little <laughs> uncomfortable to watch, but it's good. <laughs> I really can barely remember it. I just know that I have seen this. Like it's way too familiar to not have seen it. I don't know. I would put it in like D or, D or something or something. See. Gay people have not seen that. LMAO. <laughs> <laughs> Stop.
love. I'm so dead at the chat. Okay, C. People are saying C. C for me. D. Should we do C or D, you guys? I think we can put it in in C because C is looking a little empty right now. Okay, let's put it in in C. At the it same, doesn't belong there. It doesn't this. belong there. We have to put it in D. We have to put it in D. <laughs> Jurassic World is that different than Jurassic Park? Because Jurassic Park, I would put in A, but I've never seen these new ones. So I've never seen any Jurassic movies actually. Someone says Chris Pratt is a whore. So. <laughs> Okay. The dinosaurs make me gay. <laughs> I'm literally dying. Okay, wait. So someone answer Rachel. Is this different than Jurassic Park? It movies? definitely is. It's new because Chris Pratt is in it. It's okay. like the newer ones. I haven't seen any of these. So we can put we it. We have to put it. Never yet. seen them because I guess we haven't seen it. This movie with the nine. Why does it look so familiar? I've never seen that. What movie is this, you guys? Nine. Oh, it's called Nine. Literally, period. We haven't seen it. Harry Potter, this one is Prisoner of Azkaban, which honestly could debatably be, be the, the best, best one. Yeah, yeah, I'll put that in S for sure. Really? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I would put that... Wait, people... Oh my god. <gasps> oh, Controversy. Ah! Okay, controversy. Um, I bet it was some people's gay awakening for sure. <laughs> Stop. Baltimore made me gay. <laughs> I'm not like a huge Harry Potter fan. Like, you know people really get into Harry Potter, but I've definitely seen all the movies. So have you ever taken a test to see which house you're in? No. Okay, so that would be the divider of if I you're really like into it. If I'm in yeah. really into it or not. I think, what do you think you would be? What do you guys think Jen would be? I'm the main character, so I'd definitely be yeah. in Gryffindor. Gr Gryffindor. <laughs> Not me stuttering. I actually am in Gryffindor. <laughs> you I are? took the test at Harry Potter World. Wait, people think I'm Ravenclaw? Is that not I offensive? I was going to say Hufflepuff. No, stop. That's Why? That's offensive. How is that offensive? I thought Hufflepuff is the offensive one to be a part of. I'd rather be like Slytherin than... It's a muggle. Someone's like, you're a muggle. Okay, well, literally <laughs> f*** you guys. No. <laughs> I'd rather be Slytherin than Hufflepuff. Now everyone's going to say I'm Hufflepuff. I'm not a Harry Potter millennial. I actually never saw a Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a I Harry Potter millennial. <laughs> Harry Potter. I'm actually not even a millennial. Okay, when I was younger, millennials used to tell me I was Gen Z, and now that I'm older, You're Gen Z. Me I'm Gen Z. No, Gen Z tells me that I'm oh, a millennial. Okay, Do you okay. know what I mean? Yes. I'm yes. on literally the cutoff date. So. Well, what I was gonna say is I'm really recently gotten to Harry Potter. Okay, well, <laughs> I'm gonna put Harry Potter in Prisoner of Azkaban in. A. I don't think it could go Fine. in an S because it's in the middle of the series. I understand. Are there other Harry Potter movies here or is this... Oh, there are. Okay. So then fine. Okay, so if there's What's another Harry one? Potter movie that we like more, we can pump it up. American Psycho. S. I have not seen this movie before. So you think it's S tier? It's definitely S tier. It's I so feel like good. I'm going to put it in S for you. I don't know how you guys gay, but... Oh. Okay. What is this movie down here? This looks like some Dragon Ball Z type shit. Like, the knife made me gay. Literally, why does this look like Dragon Ball Z to me? Oh, it's, wait, it's Back, back to, to the, the Future. future. <laughs> I would put that in S2. No, Back to the Future is iconic. Wait, is this Back to the Future 2? Yeah, there's a giant Roman numeral 2. <laughs> okay. okay, so. S. 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 Okay. S. What the hell oh, is Oh, that's this? Bridge to Terrible. Oh, yes. iconic. Iconic. Iconic movie. And you I know that what? Movie. That movie makes me, like, weep. I'm pretty sure I, like, read this book the same year the movie came out and our class took like a field trip to the movie theater and like watched the oh, movie. Do you know what I mean? Field trips to the movie theater? We did that. This was a good movie. Yeah, I think I put it in A. Spoiler alert, it's sad. I'd put it in A too. <laughs> okay, is this Creed? Mm -hmm. I've never seen Creed. I never have either. Wait, my list is out of order? Oh, oh my god. god! When did that happen? When did that happen? Just maybe oh, go like that. that. We have to put it in never seen because we haven't seen it unfortunately. Yeah. Dark Knight? I would put it in S. But I know you've never seen it, so we'd have to put it in a. Yes. If you guys know me, you know that I I don't really like superhero movies. I heard that this movie is better than a traditional superhero movie. I don't like superhero movies but, at all. Yeah. Like, at all. And but, it's so good. So, you have to put it. You say S? Uh, yeah, I would put it in S. But is we it said we're not good? putting S movies if we don't we haven't both seen them. No, it's okay. Okay, then put it there. Um, okay. This movie, what is this called again? Dodgeball? Yes, I love this movie. This is a good I movie. I love, what's his name? Will Ferrell? Oh. <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> I like this movie. It's funny. This was such a, this period of time was like such a specific type of humor. Yeah, I know. Oh really inappropriate and like offensive humor, honestly. Where would you put it? Because I feel like you remember it better than I do. Oh, uh, like. B maybe? I would put it in C. Kind of gives me the same like yeah. like level as these movies. Okay, yeah, I agree. Dog Pound, I've never seen this movie. Me either. Dude, what is this? Why is Donnie this Darko. so familiar? Um, I would put that in A. 
I haven't seen this. Which you know, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It looks really familiar, though. So you put this in A. People say S. It is so good. Ugh. So where would you put it? A. A. Star Trek? I've never seen Star never Trek seen movies. It. Sorry, guys. <laughs> uh, Shrek? This is obviously an S tier. S, yeah. There's definitely. no way that Shrek is not S tier. Like, no. honestly, for everything about it. Like, the memes that come out of it. The culture. The culture. The music? The music was so the good. music. <laughs> Everyone on planet Earth has seen this movie. S tier. The Fall in Our Stars. Okay. I mean, um, I don't know. I think it's overrated. Like, really? Yeah, definitely. I think I could put it maybe in C or D. I would maybe put it in C. Okay, so like John Green, I like John Green. The movie is good, but mm -hmm. I don't really tend to like like cancer movies. You know what I mean? Where someone's dying in the movie the whole time is kind of uh, like sad. I know. Also, it just got so overrated. <laughs> I don't know. It's like, oh my God, it's so what? Bad. They kissed in the Einstein Tower. So Wait, weird. they did? Oh yes. my God. I think I might have just like erased that from my memory. Um, okay. Okay, so let's just I'm put it in C. C. Chicken Run. I've seen this movie. Have you seen this? No. You've never seen Chicken Run? No. I couldn't tell you what it's about, but I have definitely seen it. I don't know. I guess I have fond memories of it, but like I really don't know what it's about. Like I think I really did see this straight when it came out, which would make me literally four. I guess I'd put it in C. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Ratatouille. Ratatouille is absolutely my one of my favorite movies of all time. I would put it in my top three favorite movies of all time. Yeah, Ratatouille is a great movie. I think it yes. really is a good movie. Okay, well put it in S. Skyfall. I've never seen this. Neither. What the hell is that? Oh, it's Thor. Thor. Um, Ragnarok. Is that what it is? What? The movie. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what it's called. Yes. Oh, I've never heard of this. Thor. Where was I when this happened? I don't know. Okay, so I've never seen this movie before. Yeah, I've never seen it. You've never seen I've it. Never seen so it we have to put it in the never seen it tier. Okay, okay. Harry Potter. Let's zoom in to see which one this is because honestly, I'm not sure. Uh, Goblet of Fire. Goblet of Fire. So that was like, was that not the oh, first one? That's actually, that's like probably my second favorite. Wait, that's that such a good concept, that movie. Goblet of Fire. Oh, that's the one where they have the tournament? Yeah. 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 That one's good. I like Prisoner of Azkaban better than this one, though. Maybe you just put it in B. Okay, we're going to put it in B. This is Guardians of the uh, Galaxy. Have you ever seen that? Uh, I'm so sorry that I haven't seen all of these like superhero movies, but you know how it be. I just don't watch superhero movies, so I've never seen Guardians of the Galaxy. I know that people really like this movie though. Like they made a whole fucking ride after it in Disneyland. We have to put it in never seen. Sorry guys. Yeah. Okay. Which, which one is which this? one is this? <laughs> Jesus. Oh, Half Blood, Blood Prince. Prince. Oh, this one's good okay. too. I actually good. think we should move all of them up. So like move this one up, up here, to this one to A, and this one to B. Okay, yeah. I agree with that completely. Thanks. I'm glad we're on same page okay avatar um i've seen this movie of course you've seen it yes you know what like it's pretty cool but i don't know i also think this movie was overrated like i will say the movie itself is like crazy because it's so well done and there's like so much of it is fake do you know what i mean but like the plot and everything is just boring to me okay yeah i would probably put it in b or c i would put it in c oh my god i've seen this movie holy sh I have completely forgot about this. What is that movie? The Iron oh, Giant. Yes. I don't remember this movie. I like this yes. movie. I'm gonna put it in B. <laughs> okay. Okay, Jumanji. Is this the like new, yeah. new one? I'm the new sure one was the good. Rock is in this. Is Stop. She? Have you seen? You no. haven't seen the new one, so don't one. even bash it. I'm not bashing it. I didn't say anything. Because actually, <laughs> I saw this movie and like honestly, going into it, I was like, ew. Like, why am I watching this? <laughs> But it's really good. I'd actually put it in B. Next we have Juno, a really iconic movie. Honestly, like I'd put this pretty high. People are saying S. Okay, let's do it. I put it in S. It's really iconic. Like I feel like people could like dress up as either of those characters and you would like know who they are. If oh, they definitely. Dress up as it's Halloween. like a common co Halloween costume. Yeah, I which is why I probably put it in S tier okay. because of the <laughs> Halloween costumes. <laughs> what is this? Kubo something two strings. I do not know about this movie. I've never seen it. I've never seen this. Life of Pi. Did you see this? No. I didn't see this either. Oh, We've got Mega Mind next, which L O. <laughs> An L. I've never seen that. Uh, I haven't seen this either, but it looks so funny. Like, what the f Megamind. Wait, I have seen this movie. What a cute character. I have 100% seen this movie. He's it's looking. really unmemorable. Oh. I honestly put it down here in D. Ghost Oh, Protocol? it's Mission Impossible. Oh. I've never seen Mission Impossible. Me either. I'm sorry. And unfortunately, I haven't seen the next one either. Only The Brave. Have you seen that? No. What does this say? Fantastic Mr. Mr. Fox. I've I I've seen this. Don't know if I've seen this. It looks I'm pretty so sure this is a familiar. Wes Anderson movie. So I feel like you might have seen it. I think I have seen this before, but I'm also not sure. B or A? 
I open it in B. Ferris Bueller's Day Off, iconic movie. S. It's so good. You put it I in S. S. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I put it in S too because it's so iconic. It's inspired so many other movies too. The next movie on our list is Shawshank Redemption, which I actually have not seen. I've seen it. Can you Google it so I can like look at what it looks like? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah yeah. yeah. Where should we put it? It's like a really notable movie, so I don't know. I, I think, know. I think it should go in A maybe. All right, so let's put it in A. Mm. Toy Story, iconic. I think it a. should go in S. Because it really is like a movie of our generation. I'm going to put it up here. Yeah. Another Harry Potter. Let's see. Deathly Hollows. Oh. It's part two. Oh, so then maybe so it's an is A. like the last one. Because it is a big, yeah. Yeah, it's a big deal. Okay. I put it in A also. Actually, the part one is really good too. I don't know. I'll put it in A. The, the Prestige. Prestige. Okay, this is another iconic movie I know. But I, I have it. not seen this. How to Train Your Dragon. I never saw this movie because I think it came out like around the time where I stopped watching like animated movies for a little bit. Do you know what I mean? When you're like getting old older and you kind of like stop watching anime Same. movies for a period yeah. of time and then you start watching them again once you get older. Yeah, I've never seen it. The next movie we have is Inception which is oh. iconicism. I like that movie. There is one thing I will say I just think it's really really long. I wouldn't put it in the S tier just because I do agree I think it's I guess a little overrated. I think A. But the only reason I'm like hesitant to say that cause, is because the next movie is The Wolf of Wall Street which some might think is overrated but I would put that in S. S. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's put Inception in A, and then The Wolf of Wall Street is actually one of my favorite movies of all time. Like, dead ass. It's so good. Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, or whatever. Is that what it is? I've never seen it. <laughs> I've never I don't seen even this. need to zoom in. I know, I've never seen yeah, it. Yeah, I just want to make sure it was Spider-Verse, oh, so I didn't make that word up, because that's no. a little weird of me to make up. Again, yeah, I don't like superhero movies either, so I've never seen this, so we have to put this here, unfortunately. Hacksaw Ridge? Never seen Never that. seen that either. Another Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> Never seen that either. Oh my god. We're flopping. Um, what's this? Oh, Theory of Everything. Have you seen Love. that? Love. Yes. Yeah. That goes in like This is a good a, movie. B? I would put it in B. Prisoners? Prisoners. I don't know what that is. Never seen it. Shaun of the Dead, have you seen this? No. Damn it, I'm hating that we're, we keep getting all these movies that we've never seen. I know. Okay, here's another Toy Story movie. Which one is this though? That looks like, let's see, by the characters, I think it's either maybe the third. Three? Okay. Yes, I was right. Three is a good Toy one. Story. Three is a good one. It is good. These little alien guys are so cute. I put it in A. Gone Girl is S tier for me. Yes. Definitely. A hundred percent. I think this is one of the best movies ever. I always talk about the cool girl monologue. I think it's one of the best yes. monologues in a film. It's so good. Okay, I'm glad everyone agrees. I love when we all agree. Up. Oh, so S good. I think this A. is S too. Even though our S tier is like filled with animated movies. Okay, we've got another Batman movie here, which, oh my God. I don't, I don't think I've seen it. Look, there's literally two Batman movies down here, like next to each other. Oh wait, <clears throat> the Dark Knight. That's the Dark Knight. So where's the Dark, what did we put in the top? The oh, Dark he, this person just has a repeat, I think. Well, I've never seen The Dark Knight Rises. Okay, so we'll put that one down there because I haven't seen it either. Kingsman. I love this movie. I have not seen this movie. Okay, we'll put it in A. Fox, Fox Catcher. Catcher. Um, um, Crick and the Crickettes. Never seen that. While we're down here, though, zoomed in. Which one is this one? Harry Potter. Deathly and Hallows. Deathly Hallows Part, part One. Should we just put it at the same level yeah, as the other one? Yeah, I was one? gonna say just put it. Put it at A. Okay. And I oop, my wig is flying at the chat right now. <laughs> I've never seen this movie. I haven't seen it either. And I'm kind of sad. I think I should. Watch listen, it. I. I want to see this movie. I've been told by multiple people who know me personally that I will really like this movie if I watch it. Pacific Rim Uprising, my friend is in this movie. Um, I didn't see it though. Kent from Foursome is in Pacific Rim Uprising. I think the se the second one though. But I haven't seen it. You've never seen it? No. Toy Story 2. It was good. I liked one and three better than two. And then I've never seen four, so. I would put it in A. How to Train Your Dragon 2. We haven't seen the first one, so we've definitely not seen the second one. Lord of the Rings, you've seen this movie. Yeah, I think Lord of the Rings is like, like, like A or S. Oh my god. Okay, so you put it in A or S? A. The Joker, the new one. Unfortunately, we both have not seen this movie, but I've heard time and time again that it is so good. I bet it is S tier. Like, even just from watching the trailer, I'm like, <laughs> this movie looks so f 
I'm good. Next up, we have Pirates of the Caribbean. Let's zoom in and see which one it is because I was a huge fan of Pirates of the Caribbean. I was absolutely obsessed and in love with Johnny Depp and Orlando Bloom. I had posters of them on my wall and I literally went to like the midnight showing. The Even though when it was a school night, black. I went to a midnight showing of the premiere because I literally was obsessed with these men. The, the Curse, Curse of, of the, the Black, black Pearl. Pearl. Okay. I mean, they're all iconic. This is the first one. So this is definitely like the best one. <laughs> I'm going S tier for me. Guys, Parts of the Caribbean, ah, oh, ah, oh, Jack Sparrow. Like, I was obsessed, even though he's like a gross pirate. I was like obsessed. Oh. Lord of the Rings is the next one. This is like another Lord of the Rings movie. Have you you've seen all of the Lord of the Rings movies? Yeah, there's actually three in here. If you could zoom in and I could see which ones they are, I could tell you. The it's, Return of the King. That one you could put one? in B. Star Wars. That's definitely Star It looks Star like Wars. the first one. I've never or seen actually, Star Wars. Or actually, sorry, it looks like the second one. I've never seen Star Wars. Oh, you know what? I don't really like Star Wars. I'm not gonna lie. Like, it's good. And it's like, it's like historical, you know? But it's not my type of movie. Well, where would you put it? <laughs> maybe A. Okay. Edge of 17. This is a really good movie. Yeah, I like this movie. I'd maybe put it in S just because I feel like it's the best coming of age film that's come out in like no, the past yeah. decade, honestly. I would put it in S too. Okay, we'll put it in S. Whiplash. Oh, this? no, but this movie's apparently amazing. It's about a drummer, Miles something. Oh, I've seen this movie. This What's movie's it? really good. I would put this in A. Wiglash. <laughs> Return of the Jedi. Have you seen this? Yes. I've seen all of them. I appreciate these movies because they are like a really big deal, but I just, it's just, Star Wars is not my vibe. So where would you put it? Put it in B because there are people who really love all of these movies, so we should show respect to them. Goodfellas? I've not seen this, unfortunately. Oh, I have. That's S. I know people really love this movie. What is this? Chronicle. I don't know Chronicle either. Um. Never seen it. We put it oh yeah. Down. Never seen it. I'm like here thinking what to do. <laughs> and I've also never seen this. What is this? That's another Star Wars. Is this Star Wars again? Oh! I know, it's like, it's never ending. Have you seen this one? I don't think so. Okay, I'm gonna put it in here. Uh, next up is Parasite, which a thousand percent is one of the best movies that has ever been made, ever. It literally is so f***ing good. Rachel hasn't seen it. I haven't. I really want to. So we're definitely putting this in S tier because it's so good. Parasite made my wig flew to orbit. <laughs> <laughs> Logan, I have not seen this. Me either. Logang. <laughs> okay, Shutter Island with Leo DiCaprio. S. Really? Have you ever seen it? Yes. Um, it's definitely S. Okay, we'll put it in S. Star Trek. Never seen it. Never seen it. Our never seen it category is looking fat. I know, and you know what? It's also looking very similar. Like, there's clearly a theme of movies we've never I seen. I know, I know. It. A. I think it is A also. I have sexual tension with that clown. <laughs> oh, X-Men. You already know. We can just say never seen it. The other Lord of the Rings movie. Where did you want me to put this one? Oh, that one's an A. Jojo Rabbit. This is definitely S tier movie. I actually yeah. made Rachel watch this last night. I what really do you think? liked it. It's one of the best movies I've seen in a long time. Yes, it's so good. What is this? Is it Back to the Future again? Yes, this is the original one. The other one was Back to the Future too. Yeah. Put the second one in S tier. Okay. So we'll put Maybe the first put... one in, in S tier also. Yeah, I agree. Perks of being a wallflower. We were actually just talking about this movie. Wait, were we or was I talking about this in my head by myself? Mm, I think you were talking about it in your head. <laughs> I was talking about this in my head by myself. I like this movie. I wouldn't put it in S tier because I think it's a little overrated. I, I would say A but I think it's A. This next movie, I know Rachel's gonna wanna put in the S tier, but what I've actually it? never seen it. It's Split. <gasps> Split. So you wanna put that in S tier? Yes. Yeah. We've got yeah. Hercules. Hercules and <laughs> S, they're like freaking out. Um, okay, I was gonna say A, but people are freaking out saying S. Have you seen Hercules animated yeah. movie? I've seen it. I would put it in A, personally though. You guys are saying S tier though? You're saying absolutely nothing. You're giving us crumbs. I like Hercules. So would you put it in S or A? A. Okay. Next we have School of Rock, which I think we should go in the S tier because Oh my god, I've seen it so many times. A really icon iconic movie. I haven't seen it so many times. I have. I actually haven't seen it in a long time. Let's go down and check out this next movie we got, which I cannot tell what this is. Scott Pilgrim. Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. Versus the World. Have you seen this? Yeah, I don't know. I think it's memorable for a lot of people, but it wasn't really for me. But Brie Larson is in it. She is? I love Brie love Larson. Her. I think I would put it in A. Scott Pilgrim, A. A? Yeah. Shrek 2. 
Honestly, iconic. So good. Iconic. So good. I would put it in A though instead of S because yeah. the first one is an S. I mm-hmm. think we gotta keep this S category, keep uh, keep it clean and, and exclusive. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Sky High, we're adding to the S tier. Oh my god. I, don't I even love this movie. Discussing this with you. Uh, yeah, we don't need to discuss it. Because it's definitely going in the S tier. I've seen this movie so many times. Me too. It's so good. Our, me and Jen's favorite superhero movie. The only superhero <laughs> movie I will watch. Sky High. Snow Snow Piercer. Piercer. Have you seen seen that? No. I have not seen Snow Piercer either. Oh, I'm anxious. Another Star Wars. Nor have I seen this Star Wars movie. This one one is The Force Awakens. No, I've never seen that. Okay, so we're just going to put that in there. I've never seen Tintin. Wait, time out, because I think... I don't know about this. I don't know about this. I actually don't think I've seen it. Legacy. Born Legacy. Have you seen that? No, I was... I really wanted our never seen category to like end I know it's so big but I've never seen it I think right now while we're down here we should just add what we haven't seen since okay. we're at the end like I haven't seen this I haven't seen the Lego movie me either sorry guys The Martian I've never seen The Year Without a Santa Claus no I've seen this actually Zagura oh, yeah of course that's like one of my all time me and my brother used to watch that like every weekend I completely forgot about this such a good movie like I'm definitely it gonna be really scared to like be in my house <laughs> We've only got these last five because this one is a duplicate. So the interview, I don't like it that much. C or D? I would put it in D. I fell asleep actually halfway through. <laughs> it was long. Period. Okay, The Martian you've never seen? Mm-mm. This movie is good. I don't really like space movies that much. Like they honestly give me a lot of anxiety. People say S. I would put it in B. I would maybe put it in C. Damn. It's okay. I'm being truthful. It's just because I don't like space movies. Uh, the Sound of Music, I would put in S tier. I think it's the only musical I like. Our S tier is beautiful. Personally, yeah. I think we did a great job here. Yeah. Wally. I actually like Wally. I like Wally a lot. Okay. I would put it in A or B, though. Oh, A. A? Okay. Yeah. And our last movie, Zathora. <laughs> I watched this movie, but it really feels like a fever dream to me. It reminds me a lot of Jumanji. It is the same exact genre because they play a game. Okay, yeah. This was a good movie. You'd put it in A, right? Yeah, I would. Okay. And our final movie is going here in A. And this is our final tier list, you guys. Take it or leave it. Wow. Looking sexy. This took a lot of time. Like, holy shit, we've been on here for two hours just doing this. Mm -hmm. Because these were a lot of (laughs) movies. But yeah, guys, that is it for our tier list. That is it for the stream. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I had so much fun doing this. I honestly, I love doing the tier lists on here with you guys. If you guys want us to do more tier lists, then tweet me on Twitter at Jen McAllister and let us know which tier list we should do next. Well, thank you guys so much again for coming. I love you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.